One day after school, three friends were wandering in the woods. Point eight, three tenths, and three quarters. And they found this really cool house. And they couldn't believe it, but the door was unlocked. Now, they probably shouldn't have gone inside, but they really wanted to. And they thought they could play inside the house. Now, they saw that there were three floors. A top floor with a bed, a middle floor with a chair, and a bottom floor with a couch. There were three of them, so they thought each one of them should get one floor. They decided that whichever one was the highest value should get the top floor, the middle value should get the middle floor, and the lowest value should get the bottom floor. So they tried to figure out who was the biggest, who was the middle, and who was the littlest. But it was really difficult because we had one decimal and two fractions. The point eight said, hey guys, why don't you become a decimal like me? That way we all can compare ourselves. The two fractions knew the point eight was right. They had to all either become decimals or all become fractions. Since point eight had asked so nicely, they decided that they would become decimals today. So three tenths turned into point three and three quarters turned into 0.75. Now it was a lot easier to see who was the biggest. Clearly, 0.8 has the highest value. So 0.8 went in first and went up one ladder and then up the next to sit in the bed. 0.75 came in second, passed by the couch, went up one ladder, and then got to sit in the chair. Hmm, he's a little big for that chair. Last but not least, point three came in and relaxed on the couch. Well, these guys better hurry up and get out of the house before the number family comes home. But at least we figured out who's the smallest, who's in the middle, and who's the biggest.